welcome or welcome back to the channel today we are making jamaican easter bun very easy to make very delicious so if you want to see how i achieve this moist bun just keep on watching let's go straight to the kitchen guys So here is a run through of our ingredients. Here I have some mixed peel and some red cherry. I mince the cherry in smaller pieces. Here I have raisin. I'm using the black raisin and the brown raisin. Optional, you can use whichever one you have available. Here I also have some brown sugar and I'm going to use some white sugar also. I have some room temperature butter, two eggs, some guava jam. Yes, I love the guava jam. The guava jam let it be very moist. I also have some mixed spice and I'll list all the spice in the description box and on the screen. I have my all-purpose flour, my salt, browning. My anise seed, anise seed, give it a licorice taste. I have my vanilla, my dark stout, my baking soda, and my baking powder. So the next step we're going to do, we're going to eat up the dragon, the sugar, the jam, the anise seed, and the butter. And when the sugar is dissolved, then we're going to add our browning optional you can add the vanilla to the mix but i'm using the egg so i'm going to um, mix my vanilla with my eggs so keep on watching guys and i'll catch you back when there's a step that has to explain and we're going to do this and low flame okay
okay we're adding our raisin to the stout and now we're mixing our dry ingredients in a larger mixing bowl after mixing all our dry ingredients together after sieving then we're going to combine the wet ingredients with the dry ingredients trying not to over mix the butter then we're going to add our mixed peel and our cherry at the last step your oven should be preheated and your baking loaf pan should be already prepared so keep on watching guys and an introduction if you're here for the first time my name is nicola i enjoy cooking videos baking i'm a jamaican living in a dutch country so if you want to see more from me just keep on watching if you're new tap the subscribe button hit the notification bell so you won't miss another upload and to my returning supporters i appreciate you guys a lot thank you guys for all the support and thank you guys for always coming back and watching my videos so just keep on watching guys and i'll catch you back when we're going to the oven so just keep on watching guys and enjoy the music Okay guys, for our loaf pans, we're going to fold them three quarter way and we're going to bake these for an hour to an hour and 15 minutes depending on your oven and depending on the temperature that you're using. I'm using 300 so I have a little remaining as you see me doing here. I'm going to put it in a smaller loaf pan that way I can enjoy it as it comes from the oven yes so we're going to bake this but before baking we're going to add an extra amount of mixed peel and cherries on the top of our buns yes and we're going to top these properly then we put them in the oven so if you're watching to this far guys again and you haven't subscribed please do so at this moment and if you're enjoying what you're seeing please check out my foodlicious playlist i'll put it in the description box below and here are my buns fresh from the oven i'm testing with a knife it comes out clean so we're going to glaze these i forgot to show my glaze but for regular glazing i'm just using some honey and water boiled together and we're just going to brush these on the top after it's cooled for about 15 minutes or so we're going to remove them from the pan then we glaze the sides also when these are completely cooled then you can wrap them in your cling wrap.
with some tasty cheese yes can't have bun without tasty cheese yes and look at the texture guys very moist yes so if you enjoy this one please like the video share the video drop me a comment and remember do subscribe if you haven't as yet and to my returning supporters, I appreciate you guys a lot. Thanks for always coming back and checking out my videos. I appreciate you guys a lot. And for the newcomers, let me do a quick introduction. My name is Nicola. I'm a Jamaican living in a Dutch country who enjoys cooking, baking, both Jamaican and international dishes so join me and my journey as i share with you guys some delicious dishes so until next time stay safe stay blessed bye for now and happy easter guys enjoy it with your loved ones and with all that being said please Stay safe doing all of that, okay? Bye, guys.